Good morning. How are we doing? So I um, had a question yesterday about our five day kickstart, which has officially started today at 6 a.m. By the way, you can probably come in um, now. I'll put the link in the comments. Probably last chance you'd need to come in today. And the awesome thing about this is I had this conversation yesterday. So I'm not sure how this can fit in with my busy schedule yet. Already this morning, it's what, 6.40. There's already 10 um, ladies who have already said they've hit, hit an eight minute workout this morning, like already. And I'm thinking, that's amazing, Monday, straight in. Hey Ali, good morning. You're in on the, the five day kickstart. And when it comes to fitting it, what I don't know how I can fit this into my busy schedule. What I wanna get out here is you don't need to fit this in. You just need to fit something in because something is always better than nothing. And I know we know that already, but the quicker we actually action this, the better our results are gonna be. And I say this from a point of view of that most of the time we don't do it because we don't think it will be enough. We don't think it will make a difference. And I always say this, but of course it won't make a difference if we don't do it. That's a given, right? So, and already if I look now, like we've got 10, 10 ladies who've already done that, that workout, um, which is eight minutes long. You can do literally from laying down, um, straight in. So, and you don't have to do it live. You don't have to do it now and it's getting it done. And then we go over this later on in the day in terms of tonight, when I go over in the Q and A, um, what worked, what didn't work with the task, which is another five minute task and you're done. Um, and with this, if you, even if you can't do this, even if you can't fit in eight minutes today, don't underestimate fitting in eight minutes tomorrow. And I say this from a point of view, we, we normally feel like we have, if it's a five day art, I'm not sure what I'll be doing Wednesday or Thursday. You know, the monkey on our shoulder will start to say, yeah, no, there's no point starting if you can't keep this up on Thursday or Friday. But that's how habits are built. You might actually be a different person on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. You might actually have fit that into your lifestyle a little bit more easily on Wednesday and Thursday. You might be happier with going, you know, I can't do the full workout, but I'm just gonna do the one workout that was really short on that Thursday when I thought I couldn't do anything, but now I believe I can because something is better than nothing because I've started and I actually like the feeling. Now I like the feeling of having exercise. Like I do, I don't really enjoy exercise. That's coming from me. Um, I like having exercised. There's a difference. So I do, I like having exercise. I like the feeling it creates. Whilst I'm doing it, can I honestly say <clears throat> it's really good? I'm not sure. It's an interesting one, isn't it? But I'm focused on how I want to feel, where I want to be. And like some of the comments, some of the, the ladies have put in, in there, and, and it's always good to see where people are at. You know, I want, I, I can't lose any weight. The weight's just piling on. I'm, at the moment, I'm just avoiding social events and I want to, I need a kickstart, I need some motivation again. I'm fine with the fitness, but I need to get a handle on my snacking, comfort eating, which is exactly what we're going to be going in for. <clears throat> Ali says, what about needing a day off as did lots over the weekend, body aches and full day of work, book something Tuesday already and Thursday in person, online Wednesday and Friday. Perfect. See, yeah, you've got to, that's it. That's a, that's a good point there, you know. If you book ahead and you set those expectations, Ali, like you've done there, rather than go, I've got to fit this in, which is five days, rather maybe I say, you know what, these are the days I'm going to do exercise on, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and I'm going to be okay with that because I've set my expectation now. And now where I've set my expectation, this is what I'm willing to do. This is what I'm happy doing. And anything above that is a bonus. I might give them, I don't say you can't do it. Give yourself permission to do it if you want to, but these are the days I'm committing to. And that's the power of some accountability as well. And unfortunately, we get into this stage where we often think that we have to do it all, otherwise it'll mean nothing. Anyway, I hope that helps. And I will put the link uh, to the five day in the comments in here. Um, if you want to come in on that, we've only just started. So you're only like 45 minutes late. You'll be all right. Um, if you want to come in now and you're not in it, um, we're going to be going over free, free, our free legs of the store, if you like, across the week. So we've got the food element of it, where we're going to be going over a simple step-by-step -step plan to fit for you. Um, we've got the fitness side of it, like I said, fitting it into your lifestyle, setting those expectations, a short workout each day that you can do from home, no equipment. 
And finally, we're going to go over the accountability side of things, get you to do the things so that you know you probably know you need to do, but personalised for you with this. Then I'm live every evening, um, 8 p.m. this week, where we really delve into the task each day, delve into the more nitty gritty of this. So I can because I can give you snippets like this, but ultimately. Um, the key is when you ask the questions and we go into, okay, this is my schedule though, like Ali's already asked. And yes, you can catch it on replay um, as well. So, awesome. Any questions, let me know and I'll see you soon. Take care.